Uh, I got some good news and I got some bad news. <laughs> well, actually, it's just really good news to me. So, y'all, come on. Let me tell you, let me show y'all what's going on. Mm -hmm. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, D-Wade. Of course, you already know that. Today, what we got going on today, I'm over here in Friendship, Tennessee. And this is what I got. I had got a rented trailer. This was the only thing that they got. I wanted, I wanted an aluminum trailer, but hey, I can't be picking right now. But this is where it's at, and this is what it looks like. Actually, it matched the truck. <laughs> Looks good, man. I this like is it. a 40 foot um, 2023 steel trailer. Uh, it's an armor trailer, armor lead trailer. As you see right there on the trailer, it has 24 low profile tires on the back, on the back of it, all the way around, according to the truck. It has 24s as well. This is this rental is pretty steep for me, but I got to get back on the road. I got the I got the steel turn bolts. I mean, not turn bolts. I still need to be turning tires, and so as of right now, that's that's why I'm with right now. So far as the insurance company, they don't believe that they gon they don't believe that that they gonna fix the other trailer. So what I'm gonna do with the other trailer, we just gonna scrap it. So I'm just gonna scrap the whole trailer. Then get the tires off of them and scrap the whole trailer. So later on down the road, uh, I'm calling some people that actually have trailers for sale. Even the ones on YouTube, the one that, that watches my channel and then the ones that, you know, that responded to me, that messaged me on Messenger that they have a trailer for sale. I'm still talking to those people and I'm just waiting on them to get back at me and let me know what they asking for those trailers. Well, this is just ridiculous. You know what? I like this header. This is one I've been looking at for the past couple of days. It's a 12 row corn header. So <laughs> 12, 12 row corn header, yeah. So this is a 1293, 1293 John Deere. That'll fit, that'll fit just perfectly on my combine. It ain't even just worth me buying right now because I don't have any corn. And you know, if somebody out there want to need help selling corn, you know, I know where to get ahead of it, which is right here. I already know what they want for this one. I mean, it's too much, but, but you know, if I get it, it's just like if I get the header, uh, it needs to go to the field and it needs to be turning some hours on it. You know, I got to cash flow this, but I don't want to buy something that I can't cash flow. So that's 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 just like this. That's just like this trailer right here. I don't want to buy it if I can't cash flow it. I can buy it, but it's the cash flow part for me. We're going to hit the road, hit it again. Meanwhile... Alright y'all, I'm on my way to Kenton. So what I think about this trailer, pretty heavy. It's a lot heavier than the one I got, but it's a heavy trailer. So, you know, I can't be picky at this point. So I got to go to work. I got to, you know, money don't never stop, so so I actually like the trailer. I ain't gonna lie. I actually like it. This is going to be the vlog of the truck, the truck and trailer, the, the see, you know, we trying it out, testing it out to see how it is. So like I said, this is a rented trailer, so I'm just going to 
might get Apple to go ahead and just, you know, and go ahead and pay for it. I don't know how long I'm gonna be able to keep it, but uh, I actually like this trailer. Man. I really do. So I hit you. I see y'all when I get the when I get the pit. Okay, so now at this point, I see a big difference in the uh, trailer. Uh, it's a lot heavier pull. The truck actually know it's back there. So it's, it's real heavy. So keep in mind, like I said, this is a heavy trailer. And it's a lot heavier than the one, to me, uh, it's a lot heavier than the one I got. And, by it being a 40 foot trailer versus what I got is a 42. 42 foot trailer. So, yeah. It's heavy. It's heavy. So, let's get the stop pulling. And let's get weighed over there. And let's see what the money difference is compared to the other one. Alright, y'all. We are now in South Fulton. Alright, we are now in South Fulton. So it looks like to me, since now I can sit down and talk a little bit. You know, when you're hauling for the, not for the public, but when you're hauling for a granary like this, this is not the really the way to go. Is a heavy trailer, you need an aluminum trailer. That way you know you can get your actual reading, your actual weight. But since by me not being picky, I don't have any other choice but to use this trailer and uh so technically right now it's about it's about five trucks ahead so which is not bad and yeah, so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get in the truck and i'm gonna sit and think about it uh crunch some more numbers and then when we get on the scale, we, like I said, we're gonna see what's the difference between getting on the scale loaded, I mean, getting on the scale empty, and getting on the, getting the back on the scale loaded, and then emptying out. So that way I can see what, what the dollar amount is. So, all right. So I Until I get back to the shop, and then that way I could go over with the figures, with the weight, and all that looks like. Later. Yeah. That's how we made it back on the ground. Now let's get some introduction on the truck and trailer so far. All right, what is it I've learned today? This trailer right here versus this trailer right here. Okay, we got a 42 foot right here versus a 40 foot right here. All right, the difference between the two loads is approximately the same. Even though this is 42 foot and that's 40 foot, so the, it's, the load difference, I don't see much difference there when I was pulling this one. Now pulling this one, I don't see much. I don't see much difference in the in the weight, the load, and the velocity. So uh now far as pulling wise, okay, this is a heavy trailer. Ain't no doubt about it. This is 
heavy. Even when it's empty, it's heavy. And I don't understand it. It's it's heavier than this, if you tell me, just to be honest. But to me, they both the same. So it, it really no, no comparison there because uh, I don't know this trailer, this trailer right here wider than this one. And this one right here is longer than that one. I don't know. I don't know the difference. I mean, but other than, you know, the pulling wire, yes, it's heavy, especially when it's loaded. Yes, the truck knows it's back there and it's crying a little bit. Not as much as it's doing in this one. So, but any other time, man, actually, just to be honest, truth be told, I actually like this trailer. So, if y'all uh, haven't noticed, okay, this trailer right here is a 2023 uh, Armor Arm Arm Light, whatever. But uh, it's a 2023, and it's a rented trailer for right now. So basically, I'm renting until, I've, until I get a hold to the guy that's actually going to sell me aluminum trailer uh that's the one i'm gonna i'm gonna be be getting with the aluminum trailer so when the guy get in touch with me then that's when we're gonna go ahead and shake hands but until then i'm gonna have to run with this whether i like it or not the guy that i talked to is out of town so he won't be back until probably like a couple weeks so he's a driver just like i am so uh he's out of town so i just told him just take your time whatever when he get back, just throw me some numbers and then, hey, let's shake hands. That way I can send this one back. And But until then, I'm going to be using this one. Now, as far as this one right here, this MF is going to the scrap pile. I mean, literally to the scrap pile. So I'm just going to take the tarp off of it and send this on its way. Not unless you guys have any suggestions for me to do. Any suggestions for me for this trailer like i don't know trading in on another trailer or whatever but don't nobody want this trailer i mean it's it's better for me to just run it across the scale and then just be done with it so uh i mean i already had my shares out of it uh as far as the tires i mean i don't care uh, i'm looking to sell it as a matter of fact this trailer right here is for sale it's for sale. It's going cheap, but it's for sale. Uh, if don't nobody don't want it, then it's going across the scrapyard uh, immediately. So I'm sending this to the scrapyard immediately. And just as soon as I get hands, you know, as soon as I get free time, so now I'm back on the road. So whenever I get free time, that's exactly where that trailer's going. So uh, right now, that's all I got for you. This is just going to be the vlog, uh, the difference of this trailer versus that one. So since y'all already know, uh, it's really technically no difference in the trailer. Um, as far as weight-wise, no, it's no difference. Uh, Money-wise, probably about a $10 or $20 difference. That's it. That's all I saw, $20 difference. So like I said, that's all I got for today. Y'all, there ain't much, but y'all be sure to like, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Click the notification bell if you have any comment, click it in the description down below, and I will be glad to holler at you and respond back. Y'all keep like, share, and subscribe, man. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. Share, 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 share. All right, I'm out of y'all. One.